If you had just 10 hours to spend in a Caribbean country, which one would you pick and what would you do? I have 10 hours to spend in Trinidad and here is how I spent my time. Our flight from Barbados to Trinidad was leaving at 5 a.m. in the morning. We were out for a dinner date until around midnight. We got back to the house, had to pack, and uh, ended up arriving at the airport around 3 a.m. No sleep. I'm here to enjoy Trinidad. On my way to Suriname. This is going to be my second time to Suriname. Suriname or Suriname? It's Suriname. So in, if you're not from Suriname, you say Suriname. But if you're from Suriname, we say Suriname. Exactly. So, Guys, you haven't slept, slept the whole night. I'm so That's tired. why I'm losing hope. I'm so tired. But yeah. But you won't have time to sleep because we'll be going around Trinidad for 10 hours. Yeah, we're supposed to stay here for about 10 hours, but I don't want to. So since she has never been here, I have to show her Trinidad in 10 hours, so yeah, I'm gonna take you guys along, come along, let's go. Thank you ladies and gentlemen, you're now invited to disembark and as you do so we kindly ask that you refrain from walking under the wing. Guys, good morning. We just landed in uh, Trinidad. Um, and we are so sleepy like I was dozing off the whole time I'm trying to edit a video but I'm dozing off at the same time it's crazy but I'm almost done with the video though been editing it since yesterday but I've been super busy anyway we are in Trinidad and I'm so excited to see what it has to offer hello thank you we would never have made it to this plane but thank God we are here I can't wait to see what this place has to offer. Oh wow! What is one thing you, you really loved about this country that you are looking for at all? You want someone else like me to experience now that it's my first time? It's a vibe. What a vibe. Everybody, everybody in here knows how to have fun. Oh really? Yeah. Ah. That's, that's, okay. that's one. So I'm just going to tell you. Welcome to Trinidad. Thank you. It's rather unfortunate that you will not make it to Tobago. Yeah. But I'm gonna but try. But saw it from the air. Yeah. You told me Tobago. It's so beautiful, and it's not that big. It's the it's the most beautiful place that oh, I've ever been. Oh wow. But don't worry. Next time I'll take you to Tobago. But for now, I'm gonna make sure that you enjoy ten hours of your time right oh, here. Thank you, babe. In Trinidad. Thank you. You will eat all the food, meet all the nice people surprises people Do they eat different food uh, yeah, 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 yeah. To yeah 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 oh barbados yeah 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 very different very different oh, okay. and they they eat they eat a lot of bread man a lot of what bread 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 <laughs> ah okay we go do breakfast yeah 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 finally i'm inside trinidad well there's nothing much to tell here because we are the airport but i'll keep you guys oh my god first thing i'm noticing is the how hilly it is yeah, look at that okay. we're good hey motor you what that's what ghana is? yeah mr andrew got the plug man the plug of uh see there he's opening it It's actually the best tour guide in the whole of Trinidad oh, really? and Tobago. Make me blush. 
<laughs> Trust me, man. He's fun to be with, yeah. and he knows everything without looking into the archives. Wow. He he's a walking encyclopedia. Wow. You can ask him why is the place green, and he'll explain to you right now. Just ask him why is the why, why is the place green? Because it's not brown. <laughs> I told you. <laughs> so it's gonna be with us the whole of today and until um, we get to the airport. Am I not right? Yes. Um we're riding with Posh today. Our driver. Posh? Yes, yes. man. He's Posh. Ah, you're talking about the Posh car, you know? That's right. <laughs> Posh the driver. Right? So we'll get the little chocolate side of it. Um the chocolate side of the little relation between Trinidad and Ghana and when I say relation between Ghana is one of the larger cocoa producers in the world Trinidad is one of the smallest we produce 0, 0.0 something percent of the world's chocolate but we produce the highest grade of chocolate of cocoa for making chocolate in the world oh wow so when people buy bulk from places like Ghana, they buy all they can get from us and they blend ours into the, the others to give them flavor. Wow. So it's, it's a real high grade. It's called Trinitario Cocoa. And um, we're going somewhere for breakfast where they actually make their own chocolate. Oh, really? Using the Trinitario Cocoa. How are you to try? Yes, what you'll be trying is what we call cocoa tea. Uh -huh. Any hot beverage we have in Trinidad is tea. Oh. Okay. So, like when I was growing up, if you had a hot milk, they would refer to that as milk tea. Oh. You had. Um, we used to make tea with the leaves on the lime tree, so they call that lime bud tea. Oh. So anything I told you we're drinking is tea. Once it's a hot beverage. No, so if I hit this one, tea, tea. you can't get more <laughs> tea. <laughs> he wants more tea, more then tea. he'll want juice tea. And and I heat it up and it becomes tea. <laughs> Do something like that. Now, take a look at how developed Trinidad is. And you know that I'm so right. And it's so green. That's the first Just look around. Look at the roots. Green. So I know three major things about Trinidad. One, that it is home of one of the greatest female rappers of all time. There is always better days ahead. They start coming and I start rising. Must be surprising. I'm just amazing. I win, thrive, soar, higher. Two, that it is a home to the world's hottest chili. And three, that it is one of the producers of the world's best cocoa. Let me try this um Malta, this is what they call their malt here in Trinidad. Okay. Tastes just like the one in Ghana, right? Yeah. Exactly the same. This area we're in here, where the airport is, is Piaco. But a lot of Trinidad still carries the original names, the names of the Aboriginal people. Piaco is part of a greater area called Aruka, which is also a native name. This area we're going through now it also carries native name Oroku. We, we've remained with most of the names, however, the meanings have been lost because most of what was native was stifled by the then Spanish. Uh, a few of them we still have the meanings, but for the most part, we've lost them. So, the Queen's Park in Barbados. Yeah, right. Well, like a lot of the colonial areas, British colonial areas, would have similar names and titles. So, you do have Queen's Park over there. areas like this you'll mostly find Indian people again this was land that was sugarcane land that was given to the Indians 
after they serve their term of indentureship. There are parts of Trinidad where you find where the Indians dominate, however, pockets of Africans. And that's because in some instances, Africans were brought in as indentures, but for a very short period. And also, many of the Africans, because they couldn't own land, they couldn't do anything, were afraid to move away from the estates. So some Africans stayed on or around the estates. So that's why you find developments, not so much here, but like in a place called Kari, China, down south. This is how tired everyone is. Everyone is sleeping. Yeah. I managed. Why are we in Trinidad for just 10 hours? Actually, we were on our way to Suriname and the transit is 10 hours in the airport. So Maya made some calls and the Ministry of Tourism pulled some strings. And so we've been allowed to be in the country for 10 hours instead of just staying in the airport. Traffic, oh, I'm, I'm traffic. just going to go with the flow. Oh guys, look at their bus station. Right. Their buses okay. are red and white. All right, thank you so much. Interesting. So, are the colors of um, the, bus? the buses red and white here? Are they are all of them that color? All right, they're color coded for the different regions they work. Uh, now, the roadway you're seeing there is our old train route. The Trains came here back in 1848, but by 1968, they were considered no longer economically viable. So they were replaced with a bus system. They ripped up the train tracks and they put um, buses on the train tracks. But what was happening is the buses proved to be inadequate for the amount of people using them so the government then um, allowed people to bring in small ones like these minivans like the one we're in now um, which they call maxi taxis and then they started bringing big maxi taxis this is our main mass transit in trinidad now these um, vans you would have red traveling east to west in the north you would have yellow going from west to come to Port of Spain or to go to the north from the west. Um, you have um, green going to south. You have brown in south. You have um, uh, black also in south. So depending on the area you're dealing with, the color codes tell you where the buses would be going. Thank you in Tobago, you would have seen blue ones in Tobago. Guys, this is me walking in the streets of Trinidad. I am, I am grateful. It's really different from Barbados. It's got its own kind of vibe. It's early morning. People are out and about. It's really busy. Okay, what's the time? 8, 8 a.m. And like all shops are open. Music is playing. People are talking like it's loud. Oh, do they eat pepper here? I'm seeing them selling pepper. They eat pepper? Yeah, and like pepper, Barbados? Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No wonder you like this place. Now I get it. That's why you like the this place. The hottest pepper in the world is that's from, the reason, babe. It's from here. Wow. So that's why you love this place? No, it's beautiful. You, you go to the city, you see. It's actually, for me, it's my favorite Caribbean. Wow. Because of the pepper. Jesus, so we came to a market here early morning 8 a.m let's see what a market looks like here in trinidad uh, it's open but some people are yet to open up omg this looks like ghana fish right oh my god it smells like it it looks like it it must it, it must taste like it because it smells like it right yeah it is wow Wow. Dry fish. How far would you say uh, West Africa and Trinidad has uh, lots of similarities? Yeah, I mean the food they eat, the way the way they even arrange this. You see, 
This is that uh, pork, right? This is pork? What is this? Pork. Pig, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. So we, and we, we sell this. It's like more salty, right? Yeah. We have the really? same thing. You know, wow. almost everything that you see, the arrangement of the food, the food stuff, that's how we arrange it in, in back in really Ghana. People. That's how I told you. When I came in here, I feel like it's more African than yeah. anywhere. Like, like you see guys in, in Barbados holding the, the tomatoes. Oh, oh pepe. Yeah. Hey. You call it kompia? flavor. Oh, wow. Interesting. Hey, and avocado. Ooh. Yes, and pepper sauce. Oh, wow. Pepper sauce. Look at that. This really feels like a Ghanaian market. Wow, I'm blown away. Guys, you have come into this building where they only sell meat and fish. It's a meat and fish depot. So let's go in. Sorry, that is called what? Bechi. This is a red fish, a red snapper. Oh, red fish, bechi, and kingfish. No. Yeah. This is how you guys do it in Ghana. Exactly. Exactly like yeah. this. And they cut it and lay it like this, so yeah. it come and keep. Very impressive. After visiting the market, we took a walk around the city and I must admit it felt really really nice. I got to get a feel of Trinidad. One thing I noticed is that Trinidad is made up of people from different ethnicities. I didn't know that. So the bus stations here in Trinidad are very much like the ones we have back in Africa. And it was so amazing meeting people who watch our videos all the way from Trinidad. Shout outs to you! So this part of the Caribbean is really nostalgic. Like it's reminding me a lot of Kenya. It's interesting, I don't know. For some reason I never imagined that in the Caribbean they do this almost exactly the same as us so this is pretty cool from Ghana? Kenya Kenya? Yeah. Yeah. I think the people but let them know they are not different from me yeah we are the they same but let them know what different? no difference right they just see language of talk Sahili and different oh yeah Sahili yeah the feel like I know about the whole oh wow but I'm smart you know I follow up on the TV that's nice I'm all in different countries South Africa, Ghana. Hope you come and visit one day. Check, chat, all of them. Hope well, one day when I get money, uh -huh. I, go, I win the lot of Oh, ah. nice. All right, but right now, I deal with God and God will show me all the countries on the team. Ah, amazing. So I show me to the team, it's a different station to get the world. Mm. So you see in Africa what going on, all the wars and mm. different things in Asia and all of them. Yeah. You know? And you see all them things. Mm. So, I got a good, I understand it, the world. Okay. And God has put us to understand one another. Wow. So, blessed are you. And I hope you're, when you're going back, I hope you reach back safe. Be blessed too. Okay, thank bye. you. Okay, bye. What's the name of the place? It's chocolate the bar. chocolate bar, Mountain Pride Chocolate Bar. Finally, guys. Uh, I feel like we've been coming here for days. We're finally here. Let's go and check it out. Let's go, let's go. I'm hungry. They decided to stop selling their cocoa mm -hmm. cheaply to the foreign companies. Mm -hmm. So what they've started doing is processing their own cocoa and making chocolate. Wow. Let's go and give it a try. Breakfast is served. Oh wow, I love this. Looks very different, very tasty. You're right, babe. What did you tell me about food there? Yeah. They like using bread a lot. Yeah. Everything big, big and sharp, big and chicken, big and fries, big and everything. What's Every big? Oh. This is big. The bread. Yeah. So you see, this one is like. This is how we do it in. In, in what do you call it? Trinidad. In Trinidad. Are you gonna put it in between or what? Or you eat it like that? I can put it between. But this one, I, I just feel like. Um, you know me, I thought it was carrots. It's actually meat. Wow. 
There's a hole in it. I'm supposed to put the things inside here. Please, if there's any trainees watching, please drop a comment. Teach us how to eat this meal. What do you call this? So it's big and salt fish with tiger, we call it. Well, it's called Trigon here, the egg man. Trigon or Melanjin. Okay. It's served with a hot cup of chocolate. I think this I'm coming. I bet people have not seen it. I got a boiling pass and I... Okay, let me check. The owner of this place is a big fan. Where are you? She's always in my comment section. You know, always in my comment section. So. She got to know I'm here mm -hmm. and she gave me some of her product. Oh wow, that's so and nice. This is a lot. As a gift. It's a lot. Just, hot drop. Yeah, just hot water and you get yourself oh, really? a chocolate. We have citrus, we have mocha. Hey, where are we going to put all these things? These guys have filled our bags in the Caribbean. What is this? this is the, the, oh, this is what you're saying, you add hot water. Yeah. Look at all this. Yeah. Oh, nice. Oh, then chocolate bars. Chocolate bars. Whoa. I hope they taste sweet. This. What's that? Shaped like a chocolate. Cocoa. Time to go. So, let's hit the next spot here in Trinidad. Because like I told you, we only have 10 hours. What do you call this kind of cars in Trinidad? You like call this? it a bus, yes. Like a maxi taxi. Maxi taxi. Yeah, this is a small maxi taxi. So we are in our maxi taxi. Excuse me. Maxi get taxi. Wanna sit? Let's see where our maxi now, taxi is. I am us hungry, next. so I have to make a complaint, and you can put it on film if you want. Okay. You just came here. Let, let me see this bag. <laughs> you just came here. I have been. I heard this lady even before she started her business. I never got a bag full of chocolate. You just came here and you got chocolate because you are Woody. Well, I'm going to change my name. I'm now Andy. <laughs> I am now Andy I, 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 I told want you, my I told you, you need to you need to stop being 29. I, I am 29 <laughs> but I am Andy. <laughs> Am I the only one who's noticed how green Trinidad is? Plus, they've got lots of cocoa vegetation. Like, they're planting lots of cocoa. This is awesome. At this point, I won't lie, we were exhausted. We were just so sleepy. However, um, we thought maybe all we needed was some entertainment. <laughs> Gosh, guys, 
I just woke up. Right now it's um, 5.54. I slept. I think we slept around 1. Um, we were so sleepy. Everyone just dozed off in the car. It was so crazy. Couldn't do anything. So I found someone here in Trinidad who allowed us to sleep in his home. And I just woke up. This, I think, says a lot about the people of Trinidad. They're so friendly and so caring. So now that I'm up, I think we should head to the airport. Because we should be leaving the country by 9 p.m. But um, I think we might have to pass through, like, the city center. So I have a look at it because I still have no idea what it looks like. But I think this country is really beautiful. Hi. Miss Trudy, hey. how are you? I'm fine. Finally, I meet you. Oh. Finally. Look, tell, 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 tell all your, all your fans mm -hmm. that I took care of your husband in Trinidad. Oh. He was in Suriname. My brother was here because my father had died. Mm. So I my brother came for the funeral. So and we heard that he was in, he was in Suriname. So I told him when he get back to Suriname, tell wherever he is locating. I must see him. Oh. He got he got him, gave him my number. Yeah. He called me. I was on my way to my mechanic. Mm. I turned around, headed to the airport. I said it must be me yeah. and nobody else will me, me yeah. to take care of this guy in Trinidad. <laughs> so I, I I took care of him. Oh, that's thank that's, you that's so how much. we came up. Like you have to meet Mr. Time. Yeah, ah. I've been hearing about you a lot. So and I, so I, I, I tried to contact you, but you were doing guy for me now. Me? Yes now. Why did you try to contact me? You gave your number online for a estate and oh. then you replied to me and I told you no, it's not Kenya, it's in Nigeria. Oh. So I was trying to call you, you didn't even, even as if you, you were afraid of you're afraid of, of, of I'm stranger. Sorry about that. There's so many people trying to reach out. Hi. And it's been so busy. But yeah, I'm sorry, really, I'm happy to see you. Uh, happy to see you. Oh, now what oh, for you uh, in the flesh is you. Yeah, it's <laughs> How's your father? He's okay. I know, he, 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 I know he's, he's still he's kind of sick. Yeah, but he's okay. Thank God. Nice. And, and your brother? They're also fine. Nice. No, I'm following you. I follow you. I follow you every day. Thank you so when much. When I watch you, I watch him too. No, you know? Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. He he has told his subscribers to to subscribe to my own channel, ah. and they're, they're they're doing that. What's the name of the channel? Um, it's my my full name, Oyetayo Raymond Ojuade. Hmm. And. Whenever they, whenever they, they subscribe, they don't say yeah. Maya sent them. Oh, wow. <laughs> so I thank them. I said, thank, thank you, thank you. You will not regret it. <laughs> oh, I need to take a picture with you. Yeah, we should do that. You and uh, well, yeah. okay. <laughs> Thank you so much, guys. Go and subscribe to his channel. Mr. Tyre, good to see you again, man. Good to see this guy. You? I got, I got to, I got to uh, Barbados. The first person you saw is like. Did you bring Mr. Ty? I'm sorry, hell no. <laughs> you have to have refused to tag along. Yeah. Yeah, no, no, no. It was, it was too it was too much. It was too much, it was too much. But it was it was worth it. It was worth it. Okay, that's mm -hmm. nice. Miss Judy! Miss Judy! My name! <laughs> 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 nice, nice, nice. <laughs> Thank you so much for the food. I so when I when I when I was about to leave the last time, they cooked uh, what's it called? Suya. And I was all by myself, man. Yeah. I saw you way. eating on Facebook. Yes. I was so sad I didn't come early because that's where you eat and you go break and then you eat again. That's where I was bomb. That's where I was bomb. That's where I was. I was saw you last night. I missed it. It's it's the one that you can only in Nigeria. The one that were eating in the street, right? Yeah, yeah. And look at all this. This looks like Chinese meal, eh? Yeah, it, well, yeah, kind of. Hey, actually, you don't eat fried rice, bro. <laughs> you guys like, right? you guys like rice too much. Why not? Eh? Always rice, 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 rice. Our signature. If, if you don't eat rice, what do you eat? Ah, you eat fufu. Potato, uh, um, uh, gari, uh, pan yam, ah, uh, yam, what else? Right. Yo, but we going to die. Do you get all of oh, that, yeah? Let me switch it off for you guys. I must say thank you to Maya's friend. He was so kind. We were so tired and sleepy in the car and uncomfortable, but he welcomed us to his house, gave us a place to sleep, brought us food to eat, and took us to the airport. God bless him and his beautiful family and his wife who is a Trini. Man, Trinis are just the best. 
she's on bread guys you only have two hours to be at the airport time flies but before we get to the airport maya needs to surprise somebody um we are so excited about this you have to watch to the end to see what happens oh uh, i love trini i can't believe i've slept all this time i need to come back i just couldn't help it oh man i was just so sleepy guys uh anyway everything happens for a reason and there's only the next time so in the meantime as we go to surprise this Ghanaians living in trinidad i'm enjoying the breeze coming through this jeep oh guys i love how you know the car just opens on the top and then the wind blows through your hair anyway i have loved this experience in trinidad i've got to come back for more and i've got to say the trinis that i've met are so friendly they are amazing i just love this country i don't want to go <laughs> So I met the uh, pastor from Church of Pentecost and he loves my videos, man. Right? And he told me that I should speak to the wife on a video call. When I called the wife, she was so amazed because she's been looking for me for quite a long time. So when I arrived here back in Trinidad, even though I'm tired, I was like, you know what, can I just pull up a surprise before anything else? So that's why I'm here. Here he comes. Yeah, yeah the pastor is here. What's Miss Trudy? Miss Trudy is in the back. Miss Trudy. Trudy. <laughs> Miss Trudy. Hello. Can I give you a hug? Of course. Oh my goodness. How are you? How are you? How are you? We love you. You know we love you. Oh, thank you. We love you so much. Thank you. Uh, what do I <laughs> what do what do what do what do what <laughs> This guy got two great. <laughs> I told you I was too great. You, again, eh? oh, you are a man of your way. Yeah. I'm astonished. I'm, I'm surprised. Yeah, I told you. I'm going to see you again. It's speechless. <laughs> you know, let me bring my wife. Yeah. She doesn't know you're coming. She doesn't know. I like, that's no, the, she that's doesn't know. And there's just servicing for the two. When you see her, go. All right. All right. All right. I'm so privileged to see you in oh, person. Thank you. Yeah, my boy. I bet put two of us on. Let 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 us see. Let us see me. I even let us see. This this is Trinidad and Tobago. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, my brother. You are welcome. You are highly welcome. You. This my good brother, you know. Oh, really? Yes. And this my good brother. I've known this guy for the past 13 or 13. So when the body wow. went, like, yes. But I, I shock when I see him. That's why I come up because my church be this, you know. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, my church. I hear the come, boy. Touch up to see you. I haven't yeah. seen you for a while. The boy, the boy. You see me church. You can get American whiskey. Eh? Canada whiskey. Eh? What do you think? Is that a small place? <laughs> go crazy, you lot. Go, go. No, my love is small thing. Look at that. She's coming. No, it's small thing. Come with me. Make sure the money. Come with me. Make sure the money. I'll come and surprise you, but you thought I was joking. Yes! So we are communicating. Listen. Wow. <laughs> Thank you for not telling her. No, 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 I have to give it a secret. No, I we have been communicating. Oh, yes. 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 But he came yes. just to say hi to you. Awesome. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I'm actually like, oh. I, I booked very early morning ticket. I have a transit <laughs> because I promised him that I'll come and see yeah. him. Instead of me flying in the evening, I flew in the morning. So as soon as wow. I arrived here, I tested it, but I was so sleepy. So I went to Ali's house and slept. <laughs> Don't tell me I'm a bad husband. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell me I'm a bad husband. I've been talking to him, you know, like. Some yeah. business we kept secret. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,
Yes. Thank, Thank you so much. much. No problem. It. Look at this guy. He's always taking the videos. <laughs> <laughs> Please, Mr. Fans, subscribe to Mr. Tyler. Like, your number one content creator. What's the name of the channel? Oyetayo Raymond Ojoade. Do I spell it for you? Oyetayo. O-Y-E-T-A-Y-O. Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> Thank you so much for being so kind. <laughs> Thank you. Maya. Appreciate it. Thank you so much. Safe travel. My come out to Ghana. <laughs> you see you guys in the continent. You guys surprised me here. I'm going to surprise you guys in Ghana. <laughs> I'm telling you. I'm going to see you guys in Ghana, man. Since I landed in this country, I've been seeing opera all over the airport. Opera, opera quotes. This is impressive. Never seen this anywhere else before. I just love it. Be a force for good. Encouragement. Passiton.com. Oprah Winfrey. It has been an intense yet exciting 10 hours. But now I've got to say goodbye Trinidad and hello Suriname.